Hello, everybody. Peter Gantner here back again for another project review. This time it's Meta Soccer, of course, known around the world as football. This is an exciting project, guys. They've been around for a couple of years. This is one of those that you just look at and you go, how could this market cap be what it is, right? We're going to dive into that in a second. But before we do that, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not meant for financial advice. It's meant for entertainment and educational purposes. The goal is to give you a brief overview so you don't have to go search through tens of thousands of projects to figure out if it's one you want to do a deep dive research. And of course, I recommend that you always research all the projects that you get involved with. That's the way to really be a good token investor. So let's share the screen. If we come over here, we can see that it's on the B&B &B chain. We can go up here and see that its market cap is 438 at the time of recording. 0 0.003775, down about 1% today. We can go out here, guys, and click on all and see that these guys actually launched this right in the beginning of the bear market, right? So it started about in November, ran through to December. So these guys have fought their way through two years of bear market, keeping this project moving forward and making it continue to move in that direction, okay? In the right direction. If we come down here, we can see that it's only on one exchange, gate.io, the other or one centralized exchange. The other two are decentralized exchanges that you can get it on. And the reason why it's on QuickSwap is if you come over here, you can see that it's also on the Polygon chain. And that's a great place to do your, your Polygon swaps is on QuickSwap there. Let's do this. We can come down here and see that their circulating supply is actually verified. Okay, let's, let's get rid of that. So we can see that it is a one, 116,279,055 MSU with a total supply of 366. This is a little concerning. There's no max supply here. So we'll have to go out and email them and say, hey, guys, why no max supply? Is this mintable? Do you guys plan on minting more tokens down the road? So this is something that is a little bit of concern, but we can get that answer and put that in the follow-up video. Fully diluted market cap, $1.382 million. Not too bad, especially once I show you the project and what they've got going on and what they're doing. We can come down here and see that they hit an audit. I already have it pulled up here, so we'll open it up. We can see Meta Soccer. This was an audit that was done back in 2021. We can see they have a 10 and a 10. And of course, you can come out here and click on these and read these in depth if you want to do that. But those are good ratings for their contract by Hacken. Hacken is a tier one auditing company, okay? Let's jump over to their X and we can see they've got a lot of followers, 112,000 followers on their X. We can come up and see that they've been very active, 1,609 posts. So they've got a decent amount of posts. And now we go down here and we start talking about their tournament. So dive into daily tournaments at Meta Soccer Stars. So they've got a lot of stuff going on here, guys. I Like I said, this is one of the projects that I look at and go, how is this thing even at a fully diluted at one point something million dollars with the stuff that they've got going on here and the things that they're doing? So you can come down here and check out all the different things that they're doing on their X account. But what I want to do is jump over here to their website. So your next gen football club, get started. So one of the neat things that you can do, guys, is learn about all the different aspects of the game here. Uh, we're going to pull this up here real quick. So we've got metasoccer.com, uh, Youth Scouts. So we can come down and we can start reading about them. Youth Scouts, all about metasoccer scouting. Youth Scouts can be perceived as the entry point into the soccer metaverse, as these are the NFTs that allow participants to start building a team. So essentially what you're going to do is acquire one of these Youth Scout NFTs and that's going to allow you to be able to go in and start building the team. They've got a lot of thought behind this, guys. Creativity, when you look at how they're playing this, right? So you got attributes, age between 25 and 65, 
as you get your NFTs, the expertise, the role specifics, you've got scout special abilities, knowledge. So this is gamified, right? So you're going to get your character and then you're going to go out and start building your teams and go from there. Then you've got the players. So you've got your scout, you've got your players and you're going to come in and it's all the same stuff. You're going to start getting your players and you're going to go through and you're going to have your attributes. You're going to have your personal characteristics refer to the status of a player at any given moment. There are four categories, condition, moral, morale, sorry, morale, injuries, and form. So your players are going to be able to get injured, which is pretty cool, right? Just like in the game. And then you've got abilities and then, of course, special abilities that these characters have. And then you're going to go to stadiums. They've really put this game together well. Now, I haven't played it yet. We haven't jumped in and played. We're going to have to find out. We know it's available right now. You see the play now. And, of course, on the X, we saw that they're already having tournaments. The role of stadiums in meta soccer. Stadiums are an essential component of soccer. These are the places where millions of fans gather every year to share the joy of a win and support each other when facing a defeat. They are also an important source of revenue for clubs. Oh, wait a minute. I can profit from my stadium. So if I get a stadium, how to profit from a stadium? There are many ways to profit from a metaverse stadium, namely garnering profits from ticket sales to attend matches, renting the stadium to other teams, and then hosting events. So this is pretty cool. You can get yourself a stadium. Like I said, this is such a well thought out and established game um, this took a lot to build um, and for it to have a million dollar market cap fully diluted 1.3 million is absolutely crazy so msu what you need to know about meta soccer's token so they've got a complete write-up here guys about the token you can come in here and read that we're not going to go through and read all the stuff but uh, they do have information here about the token uh, we can go to their marketplace and it's already up and functioning, their marketplace. And this is where you can come and, of course, get started with purchasing different items that you'll use to play the game. So they have bundles, they have players and scouts. So you can buy a whole bundle here of, of 18 players. So that's probably the best way to get your team started. And then I'm sure that over time you could start to find them. And there's all different stuff here that you can go look at on that part of it so you can do the squad the training so we if we go to training here like i said guys there's a lot that has gone into this uh, my internet's running a little slow so it's coming up a little slower but there you go guys you have and you can see that you're getting a whole team of players and you can jump in here and look and see their attributes and all the different stuff about them so very good so we got bundles then you got the players themselves and then you've got, of course, the scouts that you can acquire in order to play the game. So it wants me to connect my wallet to play Meta Soccer, right? So it's popping up here. I've got training history. So if I go to training, I go there. I'm sure if I go to clubs, it's going to do the same thing for me to go ahead and build a club. It wants me to connect my MetaMask wallet on there to do that. So let's do this here. We've got a roadmap here. And then we can click right here and uh, find out more about it. guys there are billion over a billion soccer fans in the world so once this game catches on it's got a huge amount of potential and i don't know it's not nobody gave me any inside information or anything else but one of the things that i could see is the potential of maybe them getting this going and then the major soccer teams going hey this is a pretty cool concept and maybe do some licensing down the road. Again, that's just me saying, hey, what are things that could happen that could help move this thing forward, make it happen um, from there? If you get a chance, just go check out MSU Token, Meta Soccer, Next Gen Play to Earn Football Club in the Metaverse. Uh, we know that from um, Citibank, um, their Fusion GPS, a division of theirs, they're predicting that the metaverse will be an eight to thirteen trillion dollar marketplace by 2030. And if these guys, with the extent that they're doing, they could be serious players in the metaverse space with their soccer game. So with that, if you like the content, 
of this video and you want to learn more about low cap gems, one like this, it's been around already for a couple of years. You can go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below, ring the bell so you get notified on the next videos that we put out. I want to thank you for your time and watching this video. Have a fantastic day and we look forward to seeing you soon.